Warning, this video is intended to be used only as an educational supplement in conjunction with training from Lookout Mountain hang gliding. Hang gliding is an inherently dangerous activity. Never attempt to learn hang gliding on your own or without a Yushpa certified instructor. Welcome to Lookout Mountain hang gliding. You've chosen one of the best places in the world for your hang gliding training. We've been flying here since 1978 and have taught countless people from all walks of life how to fly hang gliders. We're here to show you that hang gliding can be fun, exhilarating, extreme, and even relaxing. You've discovered aviation's best kept secret, the purest form of flight, free flight. From five feet to 50 feet to 5,000 feet, hang gliding will take you where you want to go. This is only the beginning. Lookout Mountain Hang Gliding, along with the United States Hang Gliding and Paragliding Association, is here to guide you on your journey to become a rated hang glider pilot. More pilots than anywhere else have come here from all over the world to learn how to fly. This video, along with the guidance of your instructor, will introduce you to the training process and set you up for the highest potential for success on your first day. Are you ready? Our goal is to have fun, get you in the air, and on your way to becoming a hang glider pilot. On your first day, you'll meet your instructor at 7.45 a.m. in our pro shop. It's next to the launch ramp on top of the mountain. Get written directions the day before from our website. It is very important that you come on time. This is crucial. If you're more than 20 to 30 minutes late, the class will have already left for the training hills. You should consider still taking your tandem flight in the afternoon and rescheduling your hill training for a later date to get the most out of your lesson. Your first day of hang gliding is all about having perfectly calm winds, and those conditions deteriorate as the sun increases in intensity. If you're late, you've already missed an important part of your lesson, so plan ahead and show up a little early. Once you get the paperwork out of the way, you'll receive your 30-day Yushba student rating. Now that you're officially a hang gliding student, it's time to fly. You'll get a quick overview of the equipment and what this glider needs from you to fly its best. Pay close attention because this part of the lesson goes fast so we can make the most out of the ideal training conditions. There are five key elements you'll learn to fly a hang glider. Connecting ourselves to the glider and doing a hang check. Picking up the glider. Running with the glider all the way down the hill to get it flying. Controlling the glider with the shifting of our weight to keep the flying straight. And landing the glider. Starting with the first step, your instructor will help you put on a harness and helmet and show you how we connect to the glider. For safety, we always double check our connection prior to flying. This is called a hang check. After doing a hang check, we can pick up the glider. The easiest way to do this is with the control frame resting on the outsides of your arms, where your arms meet your shoulders. It might take a few tries to find the best spot for you. At first, it will feel awkward and uncomfortable, but eventually it will be easy, and you will be able to hold the glider with a very loose grip. With the glider balance, we can run into the wind to get the glider flying. Since we have not practiced steering or landing yet, we will learn to get the glider flying by running on flat ground first. Your instructor will both demonstrate and give more specific coaching on technique. But the basics are keeping the glider balanced, accelerating smoothly, pushing with your shoulders by walking, then jogging, and finally running, and keeping your head up and eyes focused on the target. Always look where you want to go. A loose grip is very important in every part of hang gliding, and your instructor may demonstrate this by letting go completely to show how little input is needed when it's all done correctly. If your first tries don't quite go right, don't be discouraged. It's your first time trying this, and all hang glider pilots overcame this challenge. To learn the last two elements of flying, controlling the glider and landing, your instructor might use a simulator or just prop up the glider and use it as a simulator. 
Hang gliders are controlled by shifting our weight. So pulling our body to the left or right, we'll roll the glider left or right. Pulling our weight forward tells the glider to speed up. And pushing our weight back tells the glider to slow down, which is how we land. Using wheels to land keeps things simple and safer, and it lets you focus on the flying. Your instructor will show you how to put the five key elements together for a successful flight. Connecting ourselves to the glider, complete with hang check. Picking up the glider, running with the glider all the way down the hill to get it flying. Controlling the glider with the shifting of our weight to keep it flying straight and landing the glider. Now you're ready to fly. Being a bit nervous is totally normal. You have a certified instructor by your side. You're going to be flying, so relax and enjoy it. Connect to the glider and do a hang check. Pick it up and get it balanced. Smoothly accelerate, walk, jog, run to get it flying. Keep running even if your feet don't touch the ground. And as your toes touch, ease your body back to slow the wing and land on the wheels. Putting each element together takes a bit of practice, so again, don't get discouraged if your first flights aren't perfection. We're learning to fly and having fun, and you'll get it. And when you do, the reward is longer flights by moving higher on the hill. At the end of your lesson, you and your instructor will go over your training checklist reviewing what you've accomplished in today's lesson and where you will pick up next time. We find people make their best progress when they fly often, so it's a great idea to book your following lesson for as soon as your schedule and the weather permit. Usually, if the weather and your progress permit, you will be launching, flying, and landing hang glider all in your very first day. You are now a hang glider pilot. Free flight in a hang glider is an amazing experience. We hope that this video and your Lookout Mountain hang gliding instructors help you take flight and you have the time of your life. This is just the beginning.